Dig Dickers in here reporting live for Farm Sim News. Welcome to the show. We'll be starting the stream soon, but first, a few tips to help make this the best stream for everyone. Number one, make sure you got some goodies to snack on. Water and popcorn is always recommended, but you can take that mild and turn it up to wild with a tall monster and a handful of Reese cups. You can be assured. DJ Goham will be enjoying something tasty as well. Number two, chat is rated PG, which stands for pretty good. And I stand for that, which is pretty good. Make sure to be respectful to yourself and others during the stream. Here at the Goham fam, we have a saying, ELE, everybody love everybody. All ages are welcome, and we love to have lots of interaction. DJ is very open and would love to chat with everyone. Feel free to post comments and questions during the stream. Number three, Chan is being monitored closely by our amazing channel moderators, who want the best for everyone. They are here to make sure the stream goes as smooth as possible so that we can all have a great time. These ladies and gentlemen are the best of the best, and we are very lucky to have each and every one of them. If you need help during the stream, their names are in blue, and we'll be happy to help if DJ is not able. And lastly, number four. I never really know what to say for the fourth option, so let's just assume that I've said something super intelligent and game-breaking. Now, no one can control themselves. It's like we've all had four shots of espresso and ate a whole box of Pop-Tarts, top of jelly, and spray butter for some unrelated reason. Or something like that. Yeah. If you're looking for links to other great YouTubers, maybe you want to buy a Get Out of Here Birds t-shirt. Or are curious on what kind of computer DJ uses for YouTube. You can find all that information in the description below. If you are already a member of the Goham fam, welcome back. I hope you enjoy the show. If you are a new member to the channel, hello and welcome. We love to have fun here, and we are glad that you've joined us. If you are ready for the stream to start, drop a hashtag Let's Go in the chat box below. Sit back, relax, and we hope you enjoy today's live stream. Rich Dick Dickerson, reporting live for Farm Sim News.
Ah, uh, yeah, what's going on, everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel. Oh, it's not up all the way. Sorry. Hope everybody's having a great day today. Yo, we've got the 20 foot gooseneck trailer by A2 Square Studio. I'm so excited to show you guys this. I found two things already. I was just driving it to point A to point B and I broke it already. <laughs> And we're going to break some more stuff today. We're going to have fun today. It's going to be a good day. How's everybody doing? Ooh, I like this song. Yeah. Oh, man. Speaking of Toothpaste Tractor, we had a couple of you guys just throwing down some mad love before the stream started. I want to give a huge shout out to Dragon Sin 1979 says, anyway, here's a little something. Guess I'll watch later. Hey, this will be available as a video as soon as we're done today. So as soon as we're done with this. We'll be ready to go. Who else we got? We got Patrick Woodkai says, what's up, DJ? Go ahead. Can't wait for this trailer. Could you test the bells that are in the game with it? Um, this is not a bell trailer. This is a uh, bulk trailer. I mean, you could put bells in it if you want to, but it doesn't have any straps on it or anything like that. Also, Trucker Madsy with the $5 super chat. New trailers. Yeah, yeah. Shannon with the hey, with the two dirty dog super chat. And Thomas Thizer with the DJ. Go ham as my hero. What's up? Is that everybody? I think that's everybody. At least the ones that were showing up there. Hey, we got some more black sheep of Alberta with that CA one or ten. Yeah, you're probably wondering where where's the where's the other camera? I literally just got. Actually, you guys want to you guys want to do some unbox therapy real quick? I just got this. Ugh. <laughs> FedEx for the win. Let's go. So what did we get? We got something in the mail today. Let's go. <laughs> Mom, DJ's opening stuff again. I gotta show this the right way so that you guys can't see my... Oh, this is this is together. Real real good. Oh, what did we get? What do you guys think I got? <laughs> chups, chups, chups. What do you think we got? What do you think? But it's gonna win. All right. It is... Another Camlink 4K. <laughs> Go for these things now. Oh, don't slow the camera down. My my address may have been on there. Uh, now we got another camera or uh, Cam League 4K because new camera going up there next week. Let's go, DJ the mail guy. Hashtag me. <laughs> oh man. Hey, what's up, Paul Stewart? He's got that thing. You know what? All the stickers. If you're new to the channel, all stickers get the maracas of awesomeness. And with the fist bumps. You get a one and a two. What's up? What's up? Did FedEx kick down my door? No, but I was literally running in here from eating tacos and heard ping pong. I was like, no, come on. And it was like, we were less than less than like six minutes, right under the six minute one mark. I was like, I gotta do the rich tick tick or some button. <sighs> shout out city. Yeah, we got to do shout out city. Hang on. How many more we got in here? Uh, let's see, Daniel, what's up, Daniel, with the $1 super chat? Farmer Blake, he says, hey, DJ, love the streams. NMC trucks are amazing. Yo, these NMC trucks are going to be crazy. We're going to be showing them off, don't you worry. And Dragon said, okay, back to work. Love you, man, have a blast. <laughs> Appreciate you, Dragon. Thank you, dude. All right. Let's, uh... <laughs> life, man, life. You ready? It's Shout Out City, baby! Oh, yeah, let's go! <laughs> Clips Clan from the 99 Cent Super Chat. Hey, oh, old timer day. We got JoJo in here. Tanya's in here as well. Tanya, good to see you. I miss you. Hope everything's well with you. We got Carson J Turk. Of course, J Turk's always in here hanging out. That's a lot of, that's a lot of emojis right there. <laughs> Shout out to you, man. <laughs> Saw your JA26 Mellow. Let's see who else we got in here. Cody Fry, OTD. What's up, OTD? Good to see you, brother. A blues looking good on you. Of course, Sassy Farmer. Sassy, couldn't do it without Sassy Farmer. Naturally, Jesse Lou, Ford only. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm a GM guy. OG Violinist. Good to see you in here again as well. Hunter, we got Dare in here. Big Bud 747. Yo, did you see J-A-H-G Modding's Big Bud with, with the ho 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 Yeah, I hope we get that in game. That'd be nice. What's up, Teddy Tiptree? How you doing? Dave as well. Daniel Miller's in here as well. Or Daniel, sorry. <laughs> Motocross for life. Sp Spricky Fox? I don't, know, I don't know what that is. Spricky Fox? <laughs> Mason as well. How you doing today? F-H Drifter with the hey, 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 hey. And then Luke, what's up, man? Trucker Mancy with the 199. What is that? Un- Boxing. Let's go. Where's the Reese cups? Uh, they're too big. <laughs> I'll show you later. They're a little bit too big. All right, let's do five more. We got Navy Freak. A Dub Mudding. We got Skipper Gaming. 
Two more! What do we get? Try not to do bad things with my fingers. Farmer Manu, of course! And who's at the very bottom? We have Ty. What's up, Ty? Ty Danielson. All right. Let's go out of here. Let's go into here. And let's go right into here. Let's bring it down. Let's bring up some music. Let's bring up some volume. Let's go. <laughs> Hasmet 7250, what's up with the $10 super chest? You are. You are awesome. Y'all ready to do this? Let's do this. Before you have any questions, if you have any questions, go in the description, like the top row. It says, uh, there's no release dates for mods. Yes, these will be coming to all platforms. No, they're not out yet. Nice and easy. There you go. What's up, mama? Love you. Hope you do have a good day. What's up, F or, uh, SF? Dubs. What up? All right. What do you guys think about this? So, yes, we've got the TLX in here, but we're not going to be talking about the TLX today. We're going to be showing this bad boy off. Actually, I will show you guys a couple things with the truck. This is the A2 Square Logistics. This looks way different than when I left the stream yesterday. <laughs> Anthony, what's up, man? With that four ninety nine super chases. Love you, videos. Love you, Anthony. Thank you, man. Appreciate you. Back through here. Uh huh. Yep. You guys were talking about this. It's got the uh, mud flaps on there. Oh yeah. Yeah. This this is sweet. So this is built on the first trailer that we got. If we go in here, like, way, way back when, right before we didn't even know who who this modder was, we got this. This trailer is built on that frame. It's not the same, but it's built on that frame. And think of it as two different things. So we're going to jump in here. I'm going to turn on the help window so I can see what's going on. Oh, we got the hype music started early. That's a bad sign. That's a bad sign. So, <laughs> so we got one thing that says open cover. Check that out right there. Uh-huh. That animation is just something else. It really, truly is. Boop, 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 and boop. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Got that right. Then we have Unfold Trailer. Now, I might be a little too close to the side of here. Oh, nothing too bad. Yep. You just saw that right. We can park stuff in here. No Barbie girl. <laughs> no, I'm not going to do it to you guys. <laughs> yep. We got all that. Now, here's the thing that, uh, that I, let's, let's get, uh, I don't actually, I don't think this is going to fit. It's, I know it's David actually made that truck. So we'll show you that later. Let's get, let's grab a Mahindra real quick. Just to show you guys, we can actually park vehicles in here skid steers telehandlers as long as it's skinny enough we're good we fit like two or three of these things in here might be close to getting three yes definitely will be available for all platforms now here's the funny thing that i've already found to break it so as you know fold unfold <laughs> um the thing's got it has uh collisions on it so it's a little bit interesting <laughs> so there's that um also <laughs> hey what's up from kcmo I don't, I don't i don't know what that is i don't know where kcmo is what is that does anybody know kansas city maybe i already broke it yep dc you're the best can't wait for the new trucks night owl they're gonna be awesome i appreciate you kansas city but here's the other thing I can force dump when this is open. So that's, to be fair though, you wouldn't force dump in this situation. Check out the brakes on that, on that Mahindra. It ain't going nowhere, dude. <laughs> hey to your sister, Abby. Absolutely. Hello, Abby. What's up? <laughs> Ayo. So here's the other thing, <laughs> Scania driver with that 55 Krona. What's up, ELE baby? Now here's the thing. I just folded it back up. That's it. It closes the back. However, we still have to unfold to put it back. Of course, very early stuff. Look, my hands. <laughs> right? Jump it. Oh goodness, maybe later. And then I think this has collisions. Negative. So that's the things that I found so far. 
There's another something fun. Again, you wouldn't do this. Normal people wouldn't do this. But it's it's a little bit uh <laughs> It's, it's not having fun. <laughs> so, that's... There you go. There's a, We're not normal. <laughs> we're not. Again, nor, you wouldn't drive like that. You know, you take a turn, do your thing, nice and easy. You wouldn't be like, you know what? Da, 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 da. Oh, no! Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> so, I don't know if, if it's messed up. I don't think it's messed up. I think it's just me. But... There you go. Y'all want to customize one of these real quick? And then and then we're going to tow it with something that has my logo on it. Because not only is A-Dub now throwing my logo on a big bud that jumps maps, not fields, maps. Uh, yeah, it's just, it, life, is, life is good right now. <laughs> I'm not. No, I'm using a controller. I tell you what, I tried using the steering wheel and the side panel. I do not like it at all whatsoever, especially for what I do like right now. I could not. I could not do what I'm doing now like that. So the uh, the tipper is going to be found right in here. Yes, it's a goose snake, but it's not going to be found in low loaders because it's not a low loader. We've got rim color, main color, design color. And then we have this right here, setups one and two. This is just going to be your capacity. So 26,000 liters and 38,000 liters. <laughs> Resetting a map after an update is so much fun, right? We'll set up some standard Nokian tires. We've got wide tires as well. You know those are 404s. Don't don't even play. And then back to standard again. Standard or a custom tire, by the way. They look really, really good. Um, how much of a basket bit? No, I'm, I like the steering wheel. The steering wheel on uh, Crash Counter? Did I? I did a little bit, didn't I? Crash Counter plus one. Yeah. 40,000 liters? It is. Well, let's find out. Let's, let's customize one. I'm going to customize one of these. To go with the truck that I'm gonna show you guys, so let's do that. <laughs> I'm not I'm not giving away my side panel. Main color, let's see. I can't remember which one fits my channel logo better. I think it's that color right there. Design. This is gonna be the top actually, which is really cool because my secondary color for the channel is white. We're gonna go white, and then set up. We could add that if we wanted to, but we're not going to. And then four fours, obviously. Let's get that. Now, I'm going to go into trucks. David sent this over. He he hit me up over the weekend. He's like, DJ, I need your logo. <laughs> Which A-Dub has done. And, and, then, and then he did this. <laughs> I had nothing to do with this. I'm just letting you know. Oh, no. I break everything. We're going to make this up to match. Main color, uh, rim colors right there. Let's see. No. Make sure blue. <whistles> Oof. <laughs> and then design color. We're gonna try and keep that right there. Now nah, you know what? We'll do the we'll do the white. White looks good. There we go. And then presets. I do love the presets. We're gonna go with some some. <laughs> it's just too much. Everything. All gold. Everything. Off road tires. Gimme gimme gimme. Yes. All the things. Now. We've got the uh, the new stuff, so I don't know if this is past testing or failed testing. I don't know if it's even in testing right now. Um, however, once it does release, all the stuff that was in vehicles has now been moved down to miscellaneous. So all the pieces that go in the very back, those are all going to be in miscellaneous now, just like uh, North Monty Company did with the Huddick. Speaking of, I uh, recorded Stone Valley for Saturday. Recorded that last night. Huddick action this weekend. Get ready. Yeah. Still going, still going, still going. It's in here somewhere. I know it is. There we go. There it is. Let's grab. Did he? There's no way. Hold up. I've got two sets of these. He didn't put my logo. Okay, good. He didn't put my logo on there. <laughs> Fellow Nebraska. What's up? There you go. I appreciate you, John. Thank you, man. I see you're on both of your accounts today, John. Let's go there. Boom. Diamond plate. Absolutely. Both, 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 both. Now, let's take this bad boy out for a spin <laughs> this is so ghetto <laughs> it's so messed up i love it let's hook up boom let's grab ourselves a trailer actually we got two trailers double trailer two-paste trailer and grab a hold Does this <laughs> that looks awesome by the way i like cheese i love cheese 
Cheese is delicious. Lancy Boy in here. Did I miss him? Lancy Boy. Oh, Lancy Boy Bat Pastor. Absolutely. Yeah, there you go. What's up, dude? Good to see you, man. How's everything? How's everything? Yeah. The tooth it's toothpaste tra <coughs> tractor. And you guys came up with it, not me. What um what do you guys want to do with this? Let's uh let's pretend like we just got done with a harvest, right? Let's pretend that we just got done with the harvest and we're going to take this and we're going to need to sell the grain, right? So here's a multi-selling station. There's that multi-filling station. Let's go down here. There we go. Cool. Your crush accepted you? Nice, nice. Um, DJ's girlfriend officially failed testing. Um, except this time it was, uh, it was my doing. Yeah. This is what it is. Let's pull over here, just like we were carting for combine, right? We're we'll open this bad boy up. We probably, yeah, we could fill up with it op or open, but <laughs> nah, I didn't do nothing. I did nothing. Let's say we got some wheat, right? We'll fill this bad boy up with wheat. Hey, hey New Horizon, Lawn Care, and Landscaping, it is all good. Perhaps DJ failed testing? DJ did not fail testing. No, 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 no. It was very obvious the DJ did not fail testing. Um, and then we'll come right here. Bounce over. Start overloading. Just gonna force dump. So it opens up, does its thing. I don't know if he has increased the speed or not. Doesn't look like the speed's been increased. So David, if you're around hanging out with us, maybe twice as fast as it's going right now. It looks like maybe it's like at 500 liters per second, something like that. Probably should bump that up to about a thousand or so. I think it'll be all right. I'm married to Farming Simulator. There you go. That is, <laughs> that truck is something else. <laughs> you the best, Ashton, you the best. But yeah, we're just hanging out, waiting on this to sell. Lancy Boy Map Tester. <laughs> Can't talk uh, too quick as it limits slow mode, yeah. Hey, said, what's up, everybody? I'm good. Thanks, DJ. How's you? It's all good today. So there you go. So that is what it's meant for, right? That's what it's meant to be used as. Just like that, or moving things from point A to point B. But, no, you will not be able to get it with my logo as as uh, me and A-Dub have figured out. Um, you can't just slap somebody's logo on the side like this. So there's that one. This holds a little bit more though. I don't, <laughs> I haven't I haven't seen him in here yet. I told him I was streaming, but I, he might be a little bit busy right now. This version, this holds a little bit more. This, this, this holds actually quite a bit more. This holds 38,000 liters, which is great. Again, sales. I don't know if this, ooh, <laughs> whoa, look at that. That is heavy. Keep in mind, the truck, the, <laughs> it's got so much power, it's pulling, boys! Let's go! Yeah! I'm just gunning it, that's it. This is not anything different or crazy from... <laughs> David, I hope you're watching. <laughs> Wheelies! So, the truck has so much power, but the trailer is so heavy that the truck is, it's literally like a bronken bull <laughs> trying to get over here. Now here's, here's my next, uh, this is six, dad, I didn't even realize. What's up guys, how's it going? <laughs> it yeeted itself. That's a fact. Now I'm curious, can I unfold the trailer while it's in the air like this? No, I cannot unfold the trailer while it's in the air like this, however, if I tell it to stop harvesting, oh, I can even unhook from it and it'll come back down. That's pretty sweet. <laughs> Time for an old Southern truck drag race. So let's unfold this as soon as, oh, he took that option off of this one. Oh. Okay, so you can't unfold this version. Only on the other version. Interesting. Huh. 
Well, I want to try some stuff. You guys willing to try some stuff with me? And unhook. <laughs> Let's pick this thing up right here. I think this might be my new favorite color on this truck. Look at that. It's a custom color, too. I've never seen anything like that. That is hot. Is David in here? There he is. What's up, dude? I found some stuff. And I got the truck. Look at that. Look at, look at, look at, look at. <laughs> so, these are probably things that you've seen as well. Um, when, now that David said he's actually the, the mod creator for this, I'm going to manage to break it already. Like, I broke it before the stream started. So, it it does this which it does not do with the other the other ones I, I don't know if it's a weight thing because i know that trucks like feel weight when you're using a fifth wheel even though the truck itself isn't weighed down um so it's kind of interesting and if you hold it hard left or hard right <laughs> it bounces a little bit um let's see oh that one was my fault i went a little bit too hard on that one Let's go to here. <laughs> uh, let's do wheelie. Let's put some wheat in there. Um, so I can unfold. And I still get the tip trigger. So it do this. <laughs> oh, while we're at it, might as well turn on the, uh, the light bars in the front. So it'll it'll do that. The thing is, I can fold it up, and it still does that. So I have the ability to fold unfold. So your idea of needing maybe two options, I think, is my. <laughs> it's the DJ model, dude. This I'm telling you. When we were in a stream yesterday, I was like, "Don't change anything. That's awesome. It does everything I wanted to do." <laughs> all right so there's that one um let's grab this one also david this is my favorite setup right here by far i love the big old dubs on here i love having the flatbed on the back this looks so cool all right let's fill up uh <laughs> have you ever done wheelies i'm, on, I'm just gonna get it this is the other version I'm just, I'm just going straight. <laughs> I think because it's so heavy and the truck's so light that now eventually it calms down, but when it starts hitting bumps again, it'll, it'll kind of do its thing. I, <laughs> I almost wonder if there's too much torque on the truck because the truck will pull just about anything. I mean, look at that. It's it's wheels are there. That's so cool. Yeehaw. <laughs> but the thing about this one, and I, I noticed you did this with this version, is you can't open it anymore. So you can't bring out the, the legs or anything. Well, I love this, man. Do I play RDR2? Yeah, I actually played RDR2 for like an hour last night. Um, as you know, I've got the double PC set up. And um, yep doing doing all that so there's that <laughs> but uh, <clears throat> mitsubishi boy what's up um cody what's up hey dj hobby yeah it has been but on millennial farmer map got it before it disappeared noise the wayward one <laughs> looks like a scene from fast and furious <laughs> all right this is the other thing that i saw i actually didn't even realize this until the stream started but i like it I don't think giants are going to like it, but I like it. Um, let's unfold this. And then the DJ model, right? <laughs> if he releases an update, I'm going to change the name on this one so I can keep it. Uh, did the girlfriend pass PC testing yet? The girlfriend failed testing. Um, the, the the testers rejected the the mod. Is that, a, is that a good way to put it? Man, I didn't know what was going on. I think it was... Yeah. So, I, uh, I, I, I failed the testing. Not, not, not DJ. I, I made the test fail. I, I told her that I'd gotten, kind of gotten over her. And I, <clears throat> there's some things I found out. We'll just put it that, we'll, we'll leave it at that and, and we'll move on. 
How's about that? Let's keep it private. Eh, it's, it's, I mean, it, it is what it is. I mean, you guys know everything. But check this out. So I'm going to unfold. And, oh! <laughs> it is a little bit of fun. What do I mean by girlfriend? Yeah, I, uh, so I was actually talking to a girl. I was talking to her for, for quite a while. Um, but, yeah, it's just not going to work. It's just not going to work. Still good friends. We'll say that. Still good friends. It's a very interesting relationship because we're still really good friends. But um, this is cool. Check this out, though. Whoop. <laughs> it's going to Wee! <laughs> Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Yes. <laughs> Obviously, I like it, but... <laughs> but yeah, the the only reason I say about this, and I think this would probably be pretty easy to just the uh, the bar down there, just take the uh, collisions off of it. Right, right. But you would put it slightly forward, and and that was what I was getting at. Is normal people wouldn't put it all the way back there, but if I had like my favorite one, I don't want to do this, but I got to do. Do it for science. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe it maybe it won't uh, interfere with this one. Oh my wheel, my rear wheels. They won't go in. Come on. All right, it's in. <laughs> so if I had, let's say, like there was a real vehicle in the back or something like that, it would collide with it. So, but that's the only thing. I mean. Which one's which? I don't even know what's going on anymore. I could have gonna turn on the. Come on. I, can I have that, please? <laughs> Maybe if I hold F nine, it'll bounce. There we go. Nice. And then we'll do the same thing here. F9. Boop. And we're good. Ta -da! <laughs> so, but there you go. That's, um, so that's what I found right here. Um, and the unload speed probably needs to be doubled. It seems like it's around 500 liters per, oh, forgot about that. It seems like it's about 500 liters per second. Might, mm, I mean, thing is i don't know even from real life how this would how this would work or how fast it would unload so i may not be the best person to talk to about this especially since most of my trailers unload at 100,000 liters a second so there you go see this is this is doable this is doable just barely barely press it there we go nice and easy don't give it the beans and i can make it drive just fine no, i don't want to <laughs> We'll get the unload. Ooh, there we go. We'll get the unload a little bit. I just think it's too, a little bit too heavy. I would you. I know you can't do update mass equals false on something like this that goes to giants. I don't think they would take it, or if they would, it would have to be a very special case. But I almost wonder: is there a way to do like update mass equals like half? Is that a is that a code that we could use? I don't know. Regardless, yo, did you guys see the uh, form some news today? The the video where the lights change colors, dude. That was that turned out so cool. It was like six or seven, it was eight pictures, and I was able to turn it into like a a video kind of thing. I thought it was so cool. The thumbnail took a little while to make as well, but again, they both looked awesome. Form some news was out super early as well this morning, and I was up late. It was literally form some news released like an hour and a half after I woke up. <laughs> it was done. So there you go. We guys think about that. <clears throat> there are a couple things with the uh, with the truck. I'm gonna show you guys a couple things that have, we've shown them in Farm Some News, but we haven't shown them on the channel yet. And since we have it in here, thank you, David, for that. Um, we'll <laughs> it's still dumping. Um, does anybody have any questions? Did my chat break? Are you guys here? My chat is not upload or updating. There we go. Yeah, my chat. I don't know when it. I don't know when it 
did the thing, but yeah, live chat, there you go. All right, um, question. Does anybody have any questions about the trailer itself? We'll pull this forward a little bit. Yeah, every once in a while stuff just freezes and that kind of thing. Let's see, where's our other truck? Here we go. Everything can be coming to console. Yes. I'm going to start doing frequently asked questions. They'll always be at the top of the description, and I've started doing that today. Does it have straps? No. Does not have straps because everything's inside. Doesn't need straps. <laughs> They're looking wildlife, goodness gracious. How much does it cost? Good question. Very good question. Go in and take a look. Can logs be loaded into it? Absolutely. Throw them in there, do your thing. However, it's going to be very difficult getting them out. Base price? $8,000. If we change... Like everything. $12,000. So we add $4,000. Test the trailer with a different truck. Works with everything that the other gooseneck trailers work with. Try the other one? That's not a bad idea. Go and let this bad boy go. Thing is, I mean. When this truck, when this TLX comes out, you're gonna want to use it. I'm telling you. Can I hold wood chips? Yes, it is a bulk trailer, so it will hold literally anything. Where am I? Why am I in there? Trucks. Oh, that's right. There we go. Um, it'll hold anything that you put in it that's bulk. Uh, also, I talked to Caveman. Caveman said that Giants sent the truck back. Um, had some scripting issues. He's trying to get it done for all platforms. We showed this months ago. We haven't showed this in a long time. Even snow and seasons? Yes, even snow. Also, Sam, what's up, dude? <laughs> I got your message. Uh, let's see. Let's let's go with... Let's do a Skerrick. Everybody likes a Skerrick. Skerrick's a good thing. Let's do... Let's see. Where's it? Tatcher? There we go. We'll put one of those on there. Let's grab our TLX flatbed. That'll work. That looks good. And then... Don't we have one more? Where's that big fat boy at? Yeah, there she is. Boom. All right. Let's do a little bit of hauling test. Does TLX uh, attach to the PTO seat? I don't know if it would or not, simply because this has the same hitch. That's something with the PTO thing. It'll work with tractors. It just won't work with uh, vehicles like this, and it irritates me. <laughs> so I was like, but... Why would you do that? Why would you do that? <laughs> All right. We'll put this about right there. We'll fill it up. Uh, let's see. We, we've been doing wheat, so we'll do wheat. And we will detach. So these are the four trucks right now available to all platforms that you can use with this. I, actually, one of these doesn't work. And I think it's this one. We're about to find out, aren't we? <laughs> Here we go. I think this is the one that doesn't work with it. Yep, yep, this is definitely the one that doesn't work with it. Um, this is done with something else, and I don't know what this was done with, but it just straight up doesn't work. Now this will work, this is uh, TTHD, actually just got an update uh, a couple days ago. Awesome truck, really cool truck actually. Oh, that's something. Hold up. The straps are a little bit too low for this truck. They used to not be like that. Interesting. It says, <laughs> that ain't a fifth wheel. It's not well scripted. Yeah. But see, this bad boy worked just fine. Let's see. So it's heavy. You could tell it's, it's wanting to... It's, it's just, wow. This is a heavy trailer. Dude, I mean, in real life, this trailer would be a feat. I mean, you would need to pull this with a 2,500 might do it, but I think you're going to want to jump up to a 3,500 in order to, to rightfully do that. <laughs> the fact that this pulls it, it's like, come on. We're either going to use two wheels or four. I don't care, but here we go. <laughs> The fact that that truck pulls anything you put in front of it, I I love so, so much. You have no idea. <laughs> 
Use the 5500. There you go. Did we just get a hey you? Oh, it was cool. We'll just haul, we'll haul it here, hanging out. Cool. <laughs> I love it. I need another musical instrument. Pe PewDiePie has the tambourines. I need to do something else. Specifically for the Primos uh, with the Bell Shredder attachment. I know it's modeled for that. I just... There we go. Pump that up. I just wanted to, to use it with anything. Trumpet? I have a trombone in the basement. Don't make me use it. And I'm not a trombone player. <laughs> Vibraslap? I might own one. So the Skerrick, no issues whatsoever. However, the Skerrick is a very heavy truck. Not only is the Skerrick a very heavy truck, um, the Skerrick also has probably more power than, than sense. So yeah, this is a this is a Hallmaster. <laughs> if you've ever seen one, well, Hallmaster, not the not the brand, but but it's still a little bit heavy for this even. I should play the banjo. <laughs> I'm all right. No, no. <laughs> all right, can't drive up the back. So we tried those. Good. Uh, semi truck should work just fine with a semi truck. We'll test it just to see. We'll just test it with this one. Base game truck. All good things. That's not it. There we go. 750s is as max as it goes. Yeah, I think you're getting into semi-territory at that point. Should work just fine. Yeah, it works just fine. So all these work good. Works uh, everything. Um, if it's North Ponding Company or if it's A2, um, they all work together. It all works fine. Clarinet. You know what? I have a clarinet case downstairs, but there's no, there's no clarinet in it. <laughs> I don't know where it is. Super chat stream. Mind you, you missed some super chats. What? How you gonna do that to me? Let's see. All right, what did we miss? Fellow Nebraska with the one dollar super chat. What's up, dude? <laughs> Who else did I miss? I hope I didn't miss anybody. Oh, I mean, they're all important. I just don't want to miss them. Let's see. Let's go down in here. Ragteros! Hey, I'm Mr. Ragteros! How long ago was that? It was 10 minutes ago? My bad, bro. Ragteros, how you doing, man? <laughs> President of the Netherlands is in here. Did the girlfriend... Nah, the girlfriend didn't pass testing. Seen for Fast and the Furious. <laughs> yeah, right? Oh, man. All right. I think we're called up now. I think we're called up. I also I had to get a new mouse. I had to get another mouse just to run the two PC setup. An automaton? What is an automaton? I'm not familiar with that. So what other questions do you guys... <laughs> Crash counter plus one. Oh yeah, the truck. So the truck, the TLX 2020, I know you guys love this thing. Boom. Here's your standard stuff. This is what's with Giants right now for testing. No Dr. Pepper today. Nope, 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 nope. I had two monsters yesterday and I cheated, so uh, none of that for me. Rim colors, stainless steel, dark uh, aluminum, chrome, all the goodies here. A lot of different colors, main colors. Again, same thing through here, really good colors. Design, even more so, same thing like that, straight down the side. I love it, I love it, and I love it again. Um, presets, we do have some presets on here. So if you wanna do like some just really cool stuff, preset, boom, good to go. Um, I'm, I, I bet there'll probably be some more presets coming on down the road as well. Will Brands, stock, sport, performance. Performance is my favorite. Um, and then you've got basically standards, rear duels, Nokian, and then back to standard, front grille, main color, design color, chrome. Um, standard is black, by the way. It's like a like a, a deep black. You can let Ryan, you can load anything that you can get in there. Metallic go ham. That's kind of what that is, isn't it? Cause that's my nitro blue, that's kind of my color. I do like it. It looks good. Um, let's see. Extras, you've got sidesteps chrome, black. Front uh, front bumper, chrome and black, uh, or you can do both chrome and black together. Found in Nebraska with the two dollars super chat. Oh yeah. Can you fold the ramps up and keep the doors open? Um, if you can, it it'll take some some interestingness to to make it happen. Um, lighting standard. You got an LED bar on the front, strobe bar on the top. Um, on the bull bar, actually, you have to have the bull bar installed to get these lights so you've got uh circle ones you got squared off ones and then you have really squared off ones leds 
<clears throat> excuse me, and then any combination of, of the uh, the twos. Kits, standard, you have a front bumper with the design color, front bumper black, front bumper steel, and then you have off-road in the exact same ones as well, plus fenders flared out as well, and off-road with the fenders flared out. So you could take it, do some off-road and stuff, just look cool, that kind of thing. And then engine setup, we have 3.3 and 4.2, uh, both uh, turbocharged uh, engines. So that's that. Ramps in the bed of the truck. I don't know why you, there's not a whole lot of room back here. You've got straps though. If you need to put anything down, you got straps back here. Let's see, where is a trailer? Here's a trailer. Let's see if we can make that happen. Let's see if we can get the rear door to open while the ramps are up. Might have to, uh, might have to do a little bit of interesting. There we go, we'll empty it out. So I've got the ramps down with the door shut. Let's go and fold this. All right, then unfold, ramps go down, force dump, force undump. We're gonna force that again and fold. So no way to keep the doors open and and have the back. Another cool thing, when you unfold the trailer, the cover disappears. Boop. And there's the cover again. Pretty cool. What happens if we unfold, unfold this? Pull the NMC dozer with the 2020? Oh man, it'll probably do it. But you can see when you unfold, it's gonna take that cover completely away. I don't know how long that, how long that took to, to code, but that's incredible. Let's go around and turn some of these trucks off. There we go. Ford or GM? I'm GM. I want a GMC. Uh, can TLX pull the Lizard cattle trailer? That is a good question because a lot of you guys use this cattle trailer. Let's give it a try and see. Cattleman. Uh, let's do Lemkin Blue design color. Orange. Why not? Tarp. Sure. Um, let's see. Fifth wheel ball it should be the ball hitch let's find out and see i guess right where in dirt mass um as far as the trailer goes we'll take a look at that actually yeah there we go just fine 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 just fine can't load it up with anything unfortunately but there you go pulls it just fine no issues whatsoever and you could of course raise and lower however you need to um not bad. Not bad at all. Shouldn't take turns like that. <laughs> there you go. Boom. Let's see. What was the... Uh, what was the other question here? There was one more that I saw. We're in dirt mass. That was it. Let's take a look and see. Let's go over here to this one. And I'm going to make it as dirty and as weird up as it possibly can be. We'll take a look at each one individually as well. TLX power and trailer are modded. To, I mean, you could, yeah, but... <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to behave right now. I'm going to behave with it today. Um, I don't do any modifications or anything like that until something is out. And past that point, those mods are completely private as well but I would like to do that with this. Yes, I am playing on PC. I'm actually playing on the, uh, because I'm gaming on my custom PC that we just built with channel members over the weekend. And, uh, or actually we started last week, didn't we? Yeah, we did. Uh, started last Wednesday. Let's go in. Let's F11. And let's find our vehicle. I don't have my vehicle selected because I'm not in one. <laughs> Here we go. All right. Let's do dirt. Dirt first, and we'll take a look and see how's our trailer look. There's even dirt on my logo. Come on now, I can't keep that thing dirty. How many bales can you get on the back? See, the thing is, you wouldn't want to use this for bales. We actually already have a trailer specifically for that that task. This guy right here, the 22 foot, and uh, you can open up the back of it and put a bunch of bales and see one, two, three, four, five, six, 12, 18. So 18 round bales total would be on that one. What do you guys think about the dirt wear on this thing? It looks good. 
It's it's like where the dirt's on everything that it should be on. That's pretty cool. How's the top look? Even on the tarp, look at that. That's cool. And then how's the inside of the trailer? Looking good down here. Not too shabby. And hey, that looks good, dude. <clears throat> do you think A-Dub? A-Dub's taking a little bit of time off today, so do you think A-Dub? I love you, brother. Let's take the dirt away. And let's add some wear. We've got to go down with this. I totally forgot. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I forgot the wrong way. <laughs> hey, no problem. No problem. I always update you guys on everything that I can think of for farm stuff. <laughs> well, you were? Uh, of course. <laughs> do you think, man? Do you think? So here you go. Here's the wear on this. Looking good. Do I have wear on my sticker? Come on, man. <laughs> there's your wear on everything you can see what's interesting is the wheels don't get the wear because they are chrome i like it looks good looks good even back here i love that yo does that move i remember you saying something yesterday about it moves look at the look at the uh, a2 square logo that's so cool man <clears throat> Excuse me. Test the dolly with the gooseneck. I can, but I can tell you 100% that it will work. Wear looks very realistic. The wear has been done exceptionally well. And then if we decided to go ham with it, here's your dirty, worn out, go ham truck with uh, A2 squared logistics. There you go. Not bad, huh? Pretty good. Boop. I have no idea when Millennial Farmer Map is going to be coming out. All I know is that they're working hard on it. That is all I know. When we find out more information, don't worry. I promise I'll let you know. Let's make it less wary. Less dirty. Not in that specific order. There we go. Now, somebody asked about the dolly, so I will give you guys a uh, demo of the dolly. So let's go through here. Let's see. Is this the, the brand new one that came out last week that I really like? I think it is. Yeah. Um, that is a lot of pink. Wow, that hurts my eyes a little bit. Rim color. Do we have chrome? Maybe? Possibly. Hey, there we go. Main color. Main color being... That's fine. Design color. I don't think we're going to get close to my color, but... Yeah, that'll work. Trelleborg, let's see if we can get some Nokians in here. Heck yeah, standards. Uh, see, decals are all right. No protection. Painted rail. Painted front and rear fenders. I like it. Cool. And then we'll give it a try. This also might be the dolly that messed up everything. I'm not quite sure. Interior? Interior looks good. And so today's kind of more focused on the trailer than, uh, than the truck. All right, yeah, I was afraid that that would be the case. So the the dollies don't actually work with everything. Let's see, might work with this though. Let's see, uh, the unfortunate part is the dolly. They will, the, some dollies will work with some things. Some dollies will work with other things. Uh, was it this dolly that doesn't work with anything? It might have been. Hold up, maybe we just need a tractor. Yeah, we need a tractor. Let's uh, let's see, how's the tractor that we got? To, oh, you know what we could do? I know exactly what we can use. One of the new tracked, 3D tracked vehicles that we got today. Let's use the Challenger and let's black this thing out. Yes, we'll give it everything it's got. This, <laughs> if this doesn't pull a dolly, I don't know what will. Get a Stara, yes! Boom, boom. It is. This is the dolly that won't hook up to anything. Stupid dolly. What in the world, man? We're just gonna get the base game one. Maybe it'll love me. Please? Please love me? See? Normal. That is the dolly that doesn't work with anything. I remember now. <clears throat> <laughs> I haven't, I haven't done, oh, is my, uh, my logos on the steering wheel? I thought I remembered him saying that. Yep. 
I totally remember that now. He sent me pictures. <laughs> He's insane. David is one of the craziest men on earth, and I love him. Boom. There you go. Now we got full control. Move it around wherever you need to go. You good? I hope they don't get one to remove the 3D tracks either. Um, that is... So that's kind of one reason why I always say with with mod videos and stuff like that anything that's new go for it and download it but any updates unless it's something that we already knew what the update was going to be hold off until i do farm sim news and i'll let you guys know if there's any issues um like the what was it the case puma 165 totally ruined the engine sound for me i love the engine sound the the other time um and they changed it. Doesn't sound like a little turbo anymore. And I'm I'm I miss it. Oh well. What are you gonna do about it? Do a zero to sixty in the TLX. Alright. So this has everything, big engine and all that good stuff. Alright. I'm gonna need you guys to start a timer for me, alright? Also keep in mind that most vehicles don't go from zero to hundred real quick. All right, you ready? Three, two, one, go. We've hit 20. It's 30 miles per hour, 41 miles per hour, 50 and stop. How'd we do? Seems pretty realistic to how this truck would be in real life as well. 13. David, your truck runs a 13. This thing will beat any Civic in the world. <laughs> Sorry, Mazda 3s. I don't know. What are we? Who are we making fun of these days? I don't even remember. As long as it's not GMC trucks, I'm all right. So what else? What else do you guys want to know about this trailer? What else can it do? What can it hold? What's the? What can hook up to it? All of them. <laughs> what else? Uh, Prius? <laughs> Prius, all right. It'll beat a Prius. Pellets? Yeah, I don't have that uh, I don't have that mod installed, but yes, it will hold pellets. You can do your pellet work with this. Can you flip it easily? David, I'm so sorry. So sorry, bro. I'm sorry. Boom. Oh, there we go. <laughs> um, is this what you were asking about? <laughs> Sharp turn. All right, let's let's empty that just while we're at it. Now, this is the biggest and the heaviest version. Yeah, custom logos are not allowed on console. Uh, custom logos are not allowed through Giants at all. At least, like, like I'm doing. Um, it's, it's kind of holding its ground pretty good. As a matter of fact, it's just kicking out. It's not, uh, it's not flipping, it's kicking out. So it's drifting which makes it a very, very tight driving uh, trailer. Just phenomenal, actually. Oh! Crash counter plus one. Yeah, that one's... Must have low center of gravity. Whatever this trailer's doing, it's it's doing it. <laughs> we ran over the speed limit sign. So there you go. <laughs> nice. What map is this? In the description, Pacific Northwest. So can it tip? I mean, it's not tipping. And I'll be honest with you, this truck is holding it in there too. Look at that. Truck's like, nope, nope. Two wheels, one wheel, four wheels. I don't care how many wheels, you're coming with me. <laughs> this truck's all right. Dude, I'm telling you, this truck is telling this trailer what it gets to do. And what it doesn't get to do. Will it hold grapes? Yes. 
Try the D11. <laughs> yep, no brand name vehicles allowed on console without the license agreement. Speaking of, we got a new one today. Carrie. It was really awesome to see that. Cypher! <laughs> Formerly known as Cypher Gaming. What's up, dude? How you doing, man? Good to see Cypher. GJ Fur President. <laughs> do I like chicken nuggets? Nope, but I do like chicken nuggies. Put some poop in it. There you go. Now there's poop in it. <laughs> Yeehaw. Yeah, the trailer lights. Yo, you got to see these things, man. Let's go in here. Let's go to nighttime. Let's go real late at night. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at it. Look at the lights. How cool does that look? That is a good, very, very good looking truck right there and trailer. Ooh, ooh. Let's throw one more. So there's your headlights. So the great thing about this setup is you get four sets of lights instead of three. Normally you would get, you know, lows, brights, and rears or something like that. Boom. Here's your parking lights. Then you get your headlights, you get your rear lights, and you get your bright lights. Ha! Huh. Not only on your rear lights, but if I can remember how to do them, we also have a movable. Uh, da, da, da. Uh, oh, there we go. We can also move those around on the back of the bed as well. So I would say you're going to be able to see about whatever you want to see. What do you want to see? Because you can see it all. <laughs> well, this thing looks great. Even from way, way over here, this looks good. Ba boom, baby. Alright, let's get back into the daytime so we can actually see what's going on. Can't turn the music back on to the lights. Come on, though. Come on. There we go. Boom. So, you guys were asking about the D11. The D11 is going to be pretty hard to pull. I'm, I'm be honest with you guys. A D11 is going to be something else. Let's get rid of a few things that we've just got sitting around. There's stuff that we're just not going to use. Do that. Good, good. Keep all these. Get rid of that. And that. And that. And I think we're good there. Okay. You guys asked for it. Here we go. <laughs> Let's, let's give it the, uh, ooh, yup, that's what we're doing there. <laughs> Boom. And then we need some type of trailer that this will fit on. Um, we need something that has extensions. Do you guys have a favorite trailer that this will, uh, that this runs with? My eyes, no! <laughs> let's see, Lula, no. Doesn't have extensions. Does this have extensions on it? Um, I thought it did, but it doesn't look like it. And I know these don't have extensions. These are just what they are. We need something that's got some side extensions or else this is never going to work. The Flegel? Does the Flegel have extensions? This one right here. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Steering axle. Yep, you are absolutely right. Let's see. Let's take a uh, boom and boom. Got him. Oh, no. <laughs> you know what? Yeah, sure. Why not? Looks good. Let's lease it. Oof. It's going to be rough. You guys better get ready. I bet David's just sitting back like, why did I give him this mod? Why? <laughs> All right. Let's unfold. That's not well. Yeah, I guess we'll have to do that anyway, won't we? <laughs> We're in the air. <laughs> Open the cover. Give me them extensions. Yes. I do love that. That's a great look right there. Ooh -wee. We did. I don't know what you know. We we should really, really get the blade for this thing as well. 
Let's just go into North Mining Company because it's going to be way easier to find in there. I actually don't even know where the blade is, but I know it's in here somewhere. So might as well come in here looking for it. There it is. Uh, we'll do the plow blade. There you go. And we'll do the ripper for the back. Make it pink. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> I am I am 100 times more excited right now. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry guys. I know your eyes are probably hurting. It it this is what this is what we do. Get this stop doing Really? I'm not even in the the zone right now. Come on now. You have a job to do. Please, can I have it? There we go. All right. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to work, but we're about to find out. <laughs> Easy does it. Easy does it. Every time my phone goes off, I'm looking down like, it's David. He's going to tell me that I'm not allowed to have mods anymore. <laughs> All right. Is that. Unfold the trailer. Please don't cause any issues. Back it up. Oh, yeah. We're going to have to take the ripper off of there. That's all right. I, I kind of figured we would have to, but... Oh. That is interesting. Hmm. Oh, the Flegel trailer doesn't have... Uh... <laughs> I, I don't think, oh, I'm like barely pressing. I think it's been trailer stuck in the ground. Yeah. I just can't get this to go back a little bit. Come on. There we go. That's as good as it's going to get right there. Uh, I just don't think it's going to happen. <laughs> and let me turn off the wheel locks. Maybe that'll help a little bit. No. I don't see it happening, guys. I'm sorry. It's It was just not meant to be. Oh, the coming off the side a little bit, isn't it? Use the big bud, but the big bud would be too easy. All right. Rip. <laughs> it's not, it's not going anywhere. But I could do that. Maybe I can't. <laughs> We tried, man. We tried. It just didn't budge. I did my best. I really, truly did. I tried so hard. Ooh, link the two with the draw button. Now that is an idea. Let's get this back kind of on there. Give me a second. This is not on here at all. You think we might be able to finesse this back onto the trailer itself oh yeah yeah we're good there we go all right the draw bar yes where is it where is it where is it um talking about this bad boy right here i think that's what you guys were speaking of module trailer we might want to use you know what no nope, no nope, we're doing it we're doing it right here uh design color gotta go pink don't we get that and then where is our fifth wheel module there it is oh yeah <laughs> no so a dub could but i don't want to take the fire away from trucker madsy dude i'm telling you his stream the other day was the best ever he he had one of the one of the big but or the uh, dozers that went like a bajillion miles an hour. 
It was the best stream I've ever been in. <laughs> All right, gimme. There we go. This could work. Put that all the way back there, and we'll grab it. D11 slides off. You have to strap it. Really? That stinks. All right. I'm just going to set cruise control, and now we're going to lock the diffs. I'm... Uh... Well, it's... Is it pulling? Yeah. But... <laughs> is it doing it the way you would want it to? Not... Particularly. <laughs> oh, oh, that's not good at all. Oh, it's not stopping. Crash counter plus one. Yeah. But the big butt's too easy. So, there you go. That doesn't... I say it doesn't work. It does. If I could get all four wheels on the ground, it would work. It's stuck. Yes, I know it's stuck. I have one more idea, though. <laughs> Hang on. Need to unhook from... That. Alright, get me out of here. Come on. We could do it. We could do it! We cannot do it. I got one more idea. We need one thing. Hey, y'all better watch out. Sassy will get you. We're going to use a dolly on the front of that. And that should work. <laughs> Those are weights. <laughs> I think this dolly will work with it. It should. We'll find out. Yep. And yes, the dozer is about to fall off again. Come on! Oh, and there goes the dozer. <laughs> Please get back up there. A little bit more. There you go. Right where we need you. Well, <laughs> I, I'm almost concerned a little bit that it might be because of the ground because you can't get good uh good pull on the ground like that oh that's all the way down that's not gonna work how do you fix that what is that going on oh no nope, that's not it here let's select the trailer that might do it um i don't know what that's doing It's just not working though. It's not coming out of there, guys. It's not gonna do it. It's not gonna do it. Can I do it though? Oh, it's, no, it's just stuck on something. What is it stuck on? Uh, stuck back here, that'd probably be why. Let's grab this and pull backwards. These other trucks, no, I refuse. The TLX 2020 gets the war or gets the job done. This is not particularly well today. <laughs> it's it's not gonna work. There's not enough weight on the uh, on the truck itself to get the wheels into the ground. Rip. Move the drawbar. Ooh, might be a good idea. I kind of want to. I don't want to stop until this works, but I don't know. I don't <laughs> I'm too far now. <laughs> it 
it's just sitting there laughing like <laughs> is he really trying this right now it's not gonna happen bud fine i'm so sorry i haven't seen anything on the class no um i want to see updates on the class but there is none there's zero updates on it right now don't worry you guys know i'll let you know as soon as i know though try just the dolly that's not a bad idea that's actually not a bad idea at all why didn't i do that to start with that's genius almost because it does the exact same thing as i need to unfold the low loader what are you talking about oh i had halfway unfolded the low loader that's why i wouldn't move i don't think we need this though get rid of that <laughs> Yeet the bulldozer! <laughs> Give me cat! Yo! I wish. That'd be fun, wouldn't it? Oh, that's not the one. There we go. Oh, crap. I'm I'm a professional, I think. <laughs> there we go. Alright, this should work just fine. I think we were just trying too many things. Even though, in real life, this wouldn't work. I'm telling you, this truck is too... Well, it's a little bit stupid. Yay. Yeah. It's working. I mean. <laughs> oh, well, I have no control. But but look at it. It's still saying, look, trailer. I don't know where you think we're going, but you're coming with me. And it's going to move it. But I'm stuck in the ground. I can't do nothing about that. The random dolly. I, <laughs> I think we've proven it can be done. Just <laughs> this truck may not be the best one for it. Yeah, chat's doing some weird stuff. Uh, chat's doing some weird stuff tonight. I'm not really sure what's going on with it, but it is what it is. Is there a trailer bigger than the BSA one? I know there is. I have a bunch of them. All right. Yes, that's good. So do we have any more questions about the trailer? <laughs> that's what the whole thing was about today. Let's pop over to here. There we go. Any more? Is Alien Jim in here? I didn't see him anywhere. Is he? And I can't type at all. Jim, are you hanging out? Are you hiding in the background? Where you at? <laughs> I don't see him anywhere. Jim, I don't see you, man. No. You didn't see anything. Shh. <laughs> so what do we think? Is this going to be something that you guys are going to use uh, use on your farm? Is this something that you guys are going to use on your... He beamed out, right? Um, as I was saying, I know we had Alien Man. Is this something that you're going to say, yes, I need this? Uh... <laughs> Alien Man, I see you, I see you. says, yes, every single day. Yes, use it for sure. It's, it's so cool because... In the United States, we have things like this. Tippers, yeah, we have tippers and stuff like that, but... Big trailers like this is what I love. We hit the roof unloading with and uh, pipes sometimes. Yeah, it just depends on how low your, uh, your building is. You just have to be careful of that. Seen a couple no's, but a lot of yeses. And I would say that's probably fair. Um, not every mod is for everybody, but as long as you can hit some people or a lot of people um i would be okay and especially judging from the previous downloads i mean this trailer has the exact same well the, well i mean not the exact same but most of the same features as the 22 foot and the 20 foot goosenecks that we've gotten in the past few weeks does it work on the uh dually 2014 yet yes yes that works yes those lights work as well um the the modder of the 2014 changed it to where it would work needs more power i think it'll i think it's just fine maybe a little bit more weight but the it's it's good i'm i'm extremely happy with where it is right now dodge ram's gonna be your favorite the nmc ram or the uh rambler i mean <laughs> those are so cool man those are so cool have dynamic hoses 
I don't, I haven't seen any. If it's not on that one, it's not going to be over here either. I haven't seen any dynamic hoses, no. Negative. Mahindra with a gooseneck. <laughs> I mean, the Mahindra's back there for sure. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, the to be fair, the trailers don't have anywhere to hook up anyway, so... Um, it would have to hook into the back back here somewhere. I'm sure it could be done. I just don't know how long it's going to take to for that to happen. Why do I put the big butt on the trailer? <laughs> it won't fit. <laughs> it won't fit at all. What mods am I using? All of them. <laughs> Every single one. If you could download it, it's in here right now. With the exception of Global Company. Nothing wrong with it. Now you need a liquid trailer. All right, fair enough. Let's go in here, miscellaneous. We got a couple new things that I haven't shown you guys yet. Now, we don't have a gooseneck version, but I imagine if you guys ask, uh, if you guys ask nicely, he may do something. I can't guarantee, obviously. Just be be nice, don't, don't be beggy. Let's go through here, a little bit further, a little bit further. Should be right in here, yes. Twelve hour logging stream. Get out of here. <laughs> yep. Just like the trailers. <laughs> get, get, and one more get. <laughs> oh, all my stuff said that. Oh no! Ow! Let's go. Welcome to the stream. Crash counter plus one. <laughs> hey, Mr. Beast just tweeted. Heck yeah, man. We've got not only a tanker for the back of this rollover counter plus one. There you go. Where's a uh, where's a voice I could use for a rollover counter? Uh, uh, this is it. Yep. Rollover counter plus one. Oh, I need to record that. Here we go. Rollover counter plus one. Rollover counter plus one. <laughs> Got him. Rollover counter plus one. You can hear me hitting the button. <laughs> That's great. So we'll back up. Boop. Now we've got a tanker on the back. And an extra trailer. Not only that, you could put like 50 of these together if you wanted to. It doesn't even matter. David, what's up, dude? Just playing. <laughs> the truck rolls over kind of easy. At least what I, at least for me it was. Let's see if we can make it happen again with a trailer on here. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> Got it. I, I still like it though. I think the trailer, I think everything's just fine about this truck. It's also me because it's a lot of fun to drive. <laughs> Mr. Beast, right? So there you go. Got all kinds of stuff. Plus the tippers on the back as well. And logging and flatbeds. Oh yeah, it's good looking, baby. It is good looking. No dubs on the trailer. Ah, oh, I, I yeah, I didn't even customize it. I just purchased it and went with it. Let's customize one of these. Let's go through here. I'll show you everything that's coming with it, at least that he's got on here right now. So we've got the flatbed, which you guys have seen. It's got the uh, the. Well, it's not a fifth wheel, it's the ball hitch on the back. We have the tippet. We have a tippet trailer. We've got the liquid or liquid and the liquid trailer again. And we have the logget and the logget trailer. Ba boom, baby. Ba boom. You're waiting for the Massey pack. You have to talk to A-Dub about that. So there you go. There's that. Looking good, looking fine. I can't wait to lick it. <laughs> Hashtag lick it. <laughs> don't. Wait. No. 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 Don't. Manure system ready? I don't think so. We could try, but I don't believe so. I don't see the hitch for him anywhere. Oh, let's give it a try. Oh, I said I was going to customize one, didn't I? Dead gummit. Uh, softer suspension. That I have no idea. 
You got it, David. That's what I was I was sitting there looking for the customization option because I haven't played with that yet. So let's uh let's get one of these. Customize real quick. Or uh trailer, sorry. You know what? Let's do this trailer right here. Because this fits with both things that I want to do. Main color, got everything under the rainbow. Which one is that? Pink. That is gonna be your frame. So we'll do that one. Blue. And then design color. Of course, these always need to be red. So we'll just keep those red. Wheel brands, we have stock, sport. So back and forth between stock and sport. We'll set up. So you got street and performance and knock in. So we're going to go with that now. Boom. Got that. Let's get rid of the tank trailer on the back. And let's go get this new one. D11. D11? Nope. Uh, the D11 dozer, that is all platforms. The new cultivator. I don't know what new cultivator you're talking about. Boom. So here is, uh, here, you can use this for running logs. Again, you can hook all these trailers together if you really want to. But check this out. Now it's a flatbed trailer with strippy strippers. Yo! I'm telling you. It's cool. It's real cool. Scoop. <laughs> Fantastic animation indeed. And I'm like, you know what? I need tankers. I need logs. I need pallets. Everything. You could. Take it all with you. Get every single one of these. Get 30 of each. It doesn't matter. Yes, the, the logo was a gift from the modder, and I'm always going to use it because <laughs> it's so cool. What do you guys think, man? Does the tanker support everything? Uh, let's see. This one does slurry and manure. Now, the question would be, because I know there's some customization options that I have not engaged yet. Let's go down and let's take a look at that. I need to put these in a different <laughs> different folder or something. I have so many mods installed, I have to go through everything. So you have the multi-product, which was those. You also have a slurry spreader as well. So slurry spreader is going to spread the slurry. This one's going to be just like that. It says it does. It says only slurry and... Well, there's only one way to find out. There's like four ways to find out, but... Diesel, herbicide, digestate, DF, liquid manure, water, fuel, milk, lumigen, AO. Actually, I have that mod installed, so that makes sense. Liquid fertilizer, back to diesel. There you go. Show us the mirror with the goose neck? I don't... I don't understand. Ah, everything indeed. Actually, the, the other one said the same thing this trailer right here so this said only well, actually it didn't say anything but it will hold all of those as well liquid trailer folds too get out of here what for road use and it slaps the logos on it look at that yo dude look at the logo right here like right below my ugly face it it picks it up it puts it on there and then the logo on the back just boop disappears Bruh. <laughs> that's yeah yeah hashtag realism yeah, the trucks are in the car section, absolutely. <laughs> Fuel capacity's on the dump. Sorry, <laughs> I'm a little like, dude. <laughs> buy another D11. Nah, all right, we're done with the D11 for today. We'll take a look at the dump real quick. Dump about the dump trailer or the dump thingamajiggies? We'll do both. How about that? I'll show you both. So, your capacities for the stuff that comes with the truck is going to be 6,000 liters, or you can book the extension on for 8,000 liters. 
that is the exact same with the trailer as well your capacities here are going to be 5,000 liters regardless of what you do oh it's got the a2 square studio logo on it get out of here dude still pending on giants end dude why are they gonna put it at two you know what? i'm i'm be nice i'm like i can't i don't want to get in trouble uh <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's pretty cool that's pretty cool and then let's go to the trailer i like how the trailer's early on in the trailers so i don't have to literally go through a thousand times tacos and tippers. sounds like you you know oh. hey look out <laughs> that's pretty funny actually this is the first mod on the list very cool uh so your capacity here you have two different capacities your first capacity is twenty six thousand liters that's going to be your base one or you could change your setup to setup number one um or from where it is to setup number one and then that's going to give you an extra 10 or twelve thousand liters so it gives you thirty eight thousand liters show the view of the mirrors from inside the truck there you go mirrors what i think of the logo it is very large <laughs> what i thought when when because i was trying to figure out what you were going to do with the logo i didn't know exactly what you were going to do this is not what i thought you were going to do but when when i realized what you were doing i was like oh you know be like a, a grand theft auto on a gta online logo like on the side of your car nope you did just like a dub and you're like you know what? let's just stretch it as far as it go and go right on the side <laughs> Uh, what about the inflatable amounts? Um, all the fillable beds. Yep, that was what I was just uh, just saying. So you've got uh, 6,000 liters and 8,000 liters, respectively. Stream is lagging. Hit refresh. I do not have Discord. I refuse to. I have... I have so much. Stream is bad. You gotta, you gotta go from 480p or 120, whatever it's showing, to, uh, to 1080. That's not my fault. That is all on YouTube. YouTube's been doing that in the United States this week. Pulling chain? Nope. Pulling chains can't happen because it uses scripts and giants won't let it happen. Yep, I do not have Discord and please don't make one. <laughs> I've already had to delete one. All right. I was about to say, stream's fine because I'm watching it. Any more questions on our good friend A2 Squared Logistics? <laughs> Love that. Uh, A2 Squared Studios uh, 20 foot gooseneck tipper trailer youtube keeps crashing on your tv yeah, that yeah i got nothing for that unfortunately youtube has to get it together right yeah youtube really needs to get their stuff together it is what it is though what are you gonna do color ops the same as tlx yes for the most part i have no idea about slot counts richard you play on pc why are you worried about slot counts <laughs> can you store pallets in it if you want to but it's more for vehicles and uh, longer, longer things. Um, if you want pallets, they've got the gooseneck trailer. They're super cheap as well, like eight grand for one of those. Um, and those have straps. This does not have straps because this has sides. So there's no point for straps. For console players. Fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah, I know nothing. I don't think David knows anything either. I think the two axles fine. I think three axles might make it seem a little bit crowded. I, I, I like the way it is. I think it looks, it looks exactly the way I would expect something like this to look. A good gooseneck trailer mod. Tell you what, this is his third gooseneck trailer mod that's releasing. Looking good. Pack file size. Um, I will have to get confirmation from him in order to release that information. That's one thing. Uh, that's one thing I try not to do. David, if you say it's cool, I can let him know. But I try not to. I try not to, yeah, you know, Farmer Manu right there. I tell you what, if Farmer Manu says it's good, it is very good. Same with Richard Dower. Both those guys, they're, they're, I wouldn't say they're quite the critics, but they, they have, uh, they have earned that right. So. Yes, mud flaps work. Yep. Already checked that. <laughs> DJ's beard's still in testing. Yeah, I went back. Sure, 12 megabyte file size. There you go, guys. 12 megabytes. Um, what's something else that's in ModHub right now that's about 12 megabytes? It's for all platforms that 
um, would help you guys a little bit. Let's see. Um, we'll see. I'll just download a few things from today. Maybe something's close to it. Um, so the Valtra A134 Brazil that came out today, that is 16 megabytes. So this trailer is even smaller than that. So whatever, whatever slot count that takes up, this is probably going to take up a little bit less than that. Um, so you go from 12 to 16, just take three quarters of that. You should be good to go. There you go. <laughs> it's a 26,000 liter, um, or you've got a 38,000 liter as well. There you go. There you go. I mean, how many 1100 kilogram weights can you actually i have a i have a uh, project with weights coming up uh, i don't know if it's going to be this weekend or next weekend it will either be saturday this week um or we'll do um we'll do it next weekend but i've got a i've got a project with weights <laughs> that's gonna be a whole lot of fun price fully spec'd out let's take a look let's go in rim color we're just gonna select stuff down here because these cost more Let's see, change that and fully spec'd out. You're going to pay $4,100 more, bringing the total from 8,000 up to 12,100. It'll be in testing whenever it's in testing. That I don't know. You are welcome, Farmer Manu. Boom. Yep. Yeah, 26,000 liters is pretty good, especially compared to the pricing of trailers that hold this mount. Yeah, very reasonable, extremely reasonable. Um, and the fact that you can add in, add extensions to make it up to 38,000. I mean, 38,000 liters is a pretty decent tra trailer, especially for pulling for a truck. You're not pulling with a tractor. You're not pulling with a semi-trailer. You're pulling it with a pickup truck. At 38,000 liters, that's pretty hefty. It's it. Sometimes it can get a little... Because we're so used to... Uh, um, we're so used to pulling stuff with trailer or tractors and, and semi trucks stuff like that. When you start thinking smaller, it's hard to put that into perspective sometimes. But this is a very respectable trailer. Planning on sending it to Giants? Wait for it. Pause. Today, let's go. <laughs> but planning. So it could not. It could happen. It may may not. We'll work with NMC Rambler. It'll work with every single NMC truck. Um, that has already been that has already been stated. Yeah. I don't know if it was. David, who stated it, I can't remember if it was T-Bone or Steven I talked to, um, but I know that I know that they were chats off. Hit refresh. Um, I know that they were definitely interested in in working together to make sure everything worked correctly. Labels, warnings, and stuff. I don't even think there are any. Well, we got these right here. Look at that. I'm all the way up here right now, and I can read that perfectly fine. Warning, watch your feet. Warning, watch your hands and fingers. What does the other side say? The same thing? Yeah. Look at that. I was so close to this. That is so hard to do. Boom. Got him. Uh, bumper pull? Um, I'm not sure what a bumper pull is. Yep, you use PlayStation 4 controller, you use any controller on PC, as long as it'll work right. You can even use an Xbox controller on Mac if you really want to. It takes an extra program, but super easy to do. Driving's been adjusted to real driving, so if it's fully loaded, you should not accelerate full throttle. Oops. <laughs> rear hitch, you would never see a rear hitch on something like this, so that would just be... Unrealistic is definitely the right word to use, but realism. <laughs> um, you wouldn't see anything like that on this. Now he tells you. <laughs> so there you go. That is, I think that's going to be just about it for, for today. Can't do a bumper pull with 26,000 liters, drags you down the bottom. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, so I think for today, for right now, without doing... That is the wrong. Really? We're going to show that? Screen one? You're going to do that in, in public, DJ? Come on now. Get it together. Professional over here. I think 
think that's gonna be it for today. <laughs> Am I impressed? Hey, if you're impressed, then that two thumbs up. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed today. Uh, Wednesdays have been a little bit more fun. We've been able to show off some really cool stuff. Uh, not only thanks to North Monty Company, but thanks to David and all the other great modders that uh, these harsh on mods. Really, Richard? No, never, not you. That's why I know if you say it's good, it's definitely good. Um, thank you to all the modders and mod creators and testers and anyone who's involved with the process, the pre-release process of mods like this and and others um because it is not an easy process by any means if you guys want something to watch when you're done with this live stream in the description right now there's a link to the live stream that david did yesterday showing this off he shows it in uh it was giants engine or whatever i don't know i don't know the mod stuff it's it's a program where he made it he's, he shows off there he's adding different things he went in the the mud flaps on the back he added those during the stream yesterday so if you want to see all that stuff's done and everything go check it out how far can you throw the trailer we'll find out the day it releases how about that i'll make you a deal <laughs> um but i'll be said hope you enjoyed if you did drop a like get subscribed to the channel if you're new join the go ham fam and make sure you turn your notification bells on as well so that you never miss daily farming simulator videos and live streams usually every monday and wednesday sometimes i like to do other stuff but uh, Monday and Wednesday is the thing. That's going to be it for me today. We'll be back with Farm Sim News tomorrow morning and hopefully new mods tomorrow as well. Um, just uh, Farm Sim News and mods Thursday and Friday this week. Saturday, we've got Stone Valley Let's Play coming out. Sunday is probably going to be Sandy Bay. I got some stuff on Sandy Bay that I need to do. So we're going to be back on Sandy Bay. Uh, chat time with DJ returns this Sunday. So we'll have some chat time. Chat time is also a whole lot of fun. And then Saturday, if I can make the, the wait video work, we'll do the wait video. If not, I have a second video planned that I know that you guys are going to want to see. Farmer Manu included. So, all being said, hope you guys have a great, awesome, wonderful watch today. I love you. Big hugs. Big love. E-L-E. Everybody love everybody. Go do something nice for somebody. Or say something nice to them. Go make somebody else's day. Today's a good day. Love you guys. Hope you have a great day. We'll see you later. Peace. Get out of here, K-Bot!